Just kind of take me through uh, today. What what what'd you enjoy about it? Uh, I just really enjoyed like the one on one time with Coach Hauser and Coach Mitch, Coach Hyper. Uh, just through camp, it wasn't a lot of quarterbacks out here, so like they actually got to work with you like real, like real for real. You've been here a couple of days now. You don't leave till tomorrow. What what, what do you continue to like about Tennessee? Uh, just the constant relationship I had with them. Like they talk to me a lot. Uh, they show my family a lot of love. And just overall, like how they just operate the place. Like Coach Hype, got something special going on here. Being able to have your family come here for this trip and have them be around it and stuff. How big is that? Just because I'm, I'm sure you know you seem like a big family kid. You want everybody to be on board with any decision you make, whether it's Tennessee or some other school. Uh, yes, sir. It's big to have my family around, just like so they can get a feel for the people. Like if I do choose to come here, uh, they get a feel for the people that I'm gonna be around every day. Like leaving me seven hours away from home. Uh, so. Yeah, they just get a feel how people are, if they're genuine, like actually really genuine or not. And that just tells a lot. What do you like about uh, Coach Halsley? He seems like he's connected pretty well with you. What do you like about him? Uh, Coach Halsley, he's just all around cool guy. He kind of act like me. Like, he, he it's like fun too, but then, like, hey, when it's business time, it's business time. Uh, I like with him on the field. Uh, he would say it's a perfect rep, but it's really, in his mind, there's no such thing as a perfect rep. Like, even if you throw a great ball, uh, it's a great rep, he's still going to coach you up after. Like, it's still something to get better on. What do you uh, What do you feel like you bring to the table? What, you know, here obviously you got a, you got a big time arm and kind of make all the throws, but what, what else do you feel like you bring to the table? Uh, I feel like just a, a true competitor, like, I'm going to do whatever whatever you need to try to get a win. Like, if I got to run it, throw it, anything. If I got to go out there and catch a pass, if we can win the ball game and I can do it and I, I can uh, affect the way we win it, then that's what I'm, I'm going to try to do. For you, kind of, what's the next part of the process look like? Um, you know, when do you kind of hope to make a decision? Kind of take me through kind of what you're thinking as far as, like, what you're looking for, what you're trying to, you know, find in the next, you know, few weeks, few months. So on the decision, uh, I kind of tell everybody this. I really don't know. Kind of do want to make a decision early, but it's like if it's tomorrow, if it's next week, a couple months, or if it's next year, it's just whenever I feel ready to call a place home. Then what's going to play into that is just the relationships I build with the staff, uh, uh, the way I think they can develop me, like to get to the next level. Uh, they can develop me being a better person, uh, just the next step in life, and then like how they offense, like offense is king. Like if I fit well in the offense and everything like that. For you, I guess you know how big is you know knowing that hype's a, a quarterbacks guy. I mean, he, he played the position at a high level. He's a left-hander like you. Um, you know, any, any kind of you know correlations there? Oh yeah, so uh, he kind of mentioned a few times like, we both lefties, but yeah, just the head coach, he, being an offensive-minded guy, being a quarterback, you already got the uh, offense coordinator who a former quarterback. He's your quarterback coach. Then that just gives you another person like to go to when you need help on something like, hey, this is confusing me or Coach Hyper just watching me uh, coming to f correct stuff like he did today.